I always really want to film all my vlogs with snow filters but my phone is so bad and the sound is so off and the image is so jittery that I restrain myself. You're welcome. I got a couple of orders yesterday so I'm just preparing some stickers that I had to print out and then I can pack those orders, get them sent and I'm currently uploading um, today's vlogmas video so I'll have to sort out the subtitles and stuff on that and get that all up ready I feel very tired today but it's okay I can be productive and slow that's real it's fine double, triple check that what I've printed out is what they actually ordered. <laughs> uh, I didn't press hard enough. Eh. Let's cut it. Let's cut it. Rather than pulling it. It's got little Father Christmases on it. Isn't that cute? I also have Holly and then this one just says Merry Christmas. I've had these for years but because I only use them like at Christmas <laughs> they've lasted me a really long time. I really enjoy when people buy more than one sticker, like when it's like a loose sticker rather than like a set and I get to like put a little pack together and make a little header card and stuff. I mean I really love putting the packs together as well, but I mean doing these little like one-off header cards and stuff is just really fun, it's a sweet little, I don't know, it's a nice time. <laughs> I'm gonna go outside again, two days in a row. It's, oh, who am I? It's pretty amazing. <laughs> I'm only going to the post box though, but the one closest to me will have already been collected. So I'm gonna go a little bit further so that I can post these orders and they'll get picked up today. So hopefully they'll get their stuff a bit quicker. But yeah, I'm gonna go outside again. So red. My phone camera is so bad. Why is the colour flicking like that? It's unnecessary. I might have to get a new phone. Even though I hate replacing my phone every two years. It's 
so wasteful but this is just it's just silly I have finished the line work for this. It took all week, I've been very slow, but I got there. Um, I've scanned it in, and now I think I'm gonna start working on tidying it up so I can drop some color in behind it. I'm not quite sure what to do with this. I think I'm gonna have to abandon the texture because I don't think I'll be able to delete out all of these tiny little white bits without it looking really weird. So that might end up being all black, even though I really like the pen, like scratchiness on there. But that's okay, this can be its own thing. And then I'll have to just make the digital one work however it needs to work. But yeah, so I'm going to get started on that while I wait for Will to come home. Which shouldn't be too much longer. And then we'll have some food. And watch Ghost Adventures! Yeah, Friday night! <laughs> right. I can't be bothered to hold the camera up because I just, I don't have the energy, so... This, this is, this is fine. It's probably better than me wobbling it around. Um, last night I scanned in that drawing and I finished it. I like cleaned it all up and changed the colour and stuff. I went with a dark green on green rather than black which I quite like I will put it here because filming screens never really works anyway so here it is yeah and I got that done last night and then this morning has just disappeared because that's what happens apparently when you don't have any energy to do things time goes faster than is possible to make you feel worse about yourself but it's fine i'm fine i'm just accepting it that's just what days are like sometimes sorry for yawning and talking is that rude i don't know <laughs> um today i have a uh, cthulhu to make can i show you um, I used to do a lot of crochet, I don't know if you will know this, because it was a few years ago. I used to do crochet mostly for job, work, that's how I made my money. I used to write patterns for magazines and at my online shop was a lot of handmade crochet items as well. But I didn't like doing it as a job. It hurts my wrists to do it, like if to do it enough to make money out of it, it yeah, I couldn't do it anymore, it was hurting me. And I got kind of bored with the process of it because I was having to do it like it just because I wrote all of my own patterns I never made something from someone else's stuff it was all my own stuff from scratch and I just started to notice that the patterns I were writing were kind of basic and just the same as the other patterns I'd written and I wasn't really putting full effort into it anymore and I was like it's probably because I don't want to be doing it and also there were a lot of really lovely people, don't get me wrong, 
I had lots of really really good customers and it was it was nice doing crochet stuff and I met a lot of nice people who were very nice to me and it was lovely but all of the negative difficult customers that I have had have all been people that have come from wanting crochet stuff like I say they were a minority of the people but it was just another thing I was like all of my drawing stuff I've only ever had people be nice and easy <laughs> and then any difficulties of dealing with customers has come from the crochet thing so it was just another thing where all together like it's hurt in my hands people can be difficult I'm not really doing a very good job of it anymore <laughs> so yeah I stopped doing it but I still had a couple of made to order items in my Etsy shop and some patterns but now I'm letting that all end so I'm not going to have any of the crochet stuff in my shop anymore and there's a couple of things left and yeah so I, today I have to make the Cthulhu because it's quite it's worked out really well actually because this pattern not pattern this item listing was going to run out and end but it's nice that it's been sold instead so that's worked out nicely but yeah here is the picture too many cables Mm, you can kind of see it. There you go. Crochet Cthulhu. So I, I, I really like him. I'm glad I get to make another one. It's actually because it's been a few years now. I, like I love crochet. I think it's brilliant. It's such a nice medium. I love building up shapes and I love all the different stitches and stuff. I think it's great. I really do love it. I'm starting to want to do more of it again now. But still, not as, like, work. But, yeah. What was I talking about? I just went off on one about how I used to do crochet. But, yeah, today I'm making that. <laughs> and it's my mum's birthday next week, so I want to do a drawing. I make a card for her. I might start that today. There was something else I thought about doing. I can't remember what that was. Yeah, I'm going to start off with this, get this done so I can get it posted as soon as possible for them. And I've got my Harry Potter box set and I'm just going to watch Harry Potter and do a bit of crochet, do a bit of drawing. So yeah, that took me a long time to explain. But. We're ready for you now. Follow me. I've got all my pieces made. Look at your tentacles. And I've eaten a lot of biscuits. And now it's time to pin all the bits together and finish it off. No, it can't be. Snape, you were. You were yes. I tried to kill you. And trust me, if Snape's cloak hadn't caught fire and broken my eye contact, I would have succeeded. Even with Snape muttering his little counter curse. There we go. Cthulhu is done. He's got his little wings and all his tentacles and his bead little eyes. <laughs> And he even stands up if you squish him just right. <laughs> Job done. It's the evening now. I totally drew a blank on what to draw for my mum, so I still have to figure that out at some point. But I've just been doodling about anyway, so that I've still been drawing. We've jumped up in the production quality of Harry Potter now we're on Prisoner of Azkaban the difference is amazing like when you <laughs> watch them all in a row really quickly like that it's it's, it's very noticeable that they realised how popular and how much money they were going to make out of these films <laughs> they started really investing in them <laughs> not that the first two are bad, I love them but this is just like, I don't know enough about making films to even explain why it's better. It's 
been quite a cosy afternoon.